Over the last few months, I've worked with a few women who have mentioned how when they were a child, their mother um, forced them to stay at the dinner table and said that they weren't allowed to leave until they finished their plate of food. And I know that this seems like quite a, a small, insignificant thing, but unfortunately for a lot of women, this has actually become a traumatic experience. And when you look at a, a deeper layer, them being forced to sit at the table and not allowed to leave until they finish their plate of food unfortunately taught them to ignore the signals that their body was sending them so signals of feeling full of feeling satisfied and unfortunately as well then there was feelings of guilt and shame then associated with food and then unfortunately that has resulted in really affecting their behavior and how they look at food now well into their you know these these women that i'm working with are in their 30s 40s 50s so this is a, a traumatic experience that has stayed with them their whole life and has really changed a, a lot of things but the biggest two things are the guilt and shame that's associated around food and um, obviously as a result of you being taught to ignore feelings of being full and satisfied it means that you end up overeating a lot you're you're in a calorie surplus so you're eating more um, food than your body needs and then unfortunately that uh, leads to you know gaining weight it causes you then uh, to if you've gained some weight you might have gone up a few dress sizes and then it has a huge effect on your body confidence and you know one thing kind of leads to another so um, I think it's just really important thing to highlight because this is something that's popped up a good few times and um, yeah I just wanted to share it with you today and uh, I suppose the important thing around trauma is that you know you don't have to have been in World War II or have had some life-changing event like you lost a leg or something crazy happened traumatic experiences can be you know even things that you would maybe consider to be small are, are not significant so I think that's really important around trauma like it doesn't have to be massive life-changing thing even just experiences like that when you're young can really have a huge effect on how you feel about yourself and how you approach uh, things like food and, and stuff like that so yeah hope the video was helpful if you have any questions uh, please let me know and hope you enjoy the rest of your day